Hey, now, what about this flog here, Merv, right, oh, Jim, please. who keeps telling us he's a very good cricketer. Very, Aver- very good cricketer. Average now, what, you, keep, you keep your cricket prowess under, under the table. Oh, and, well, I don't like have, good, you, have you told people reason. that you're 12th man for Victoria? Oh, well, when you, I did, when you were bowling. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, well, because they obviously someone got injured and they dragged a second 11 cricketer from Essendon. Third, third 11. Third 11. <laughs> To come and field and it happened well, to be built. A sixteen-year-old, very, very shy, quiet person. It yes. was too. They, they could speak English. Yeah. Well, who are you playing against? Uh, Tazzy, Danny Buckingham, oh, and you're yeah. bowling to Danny Buckingham. Bowling uh, at Danny Buckingham. At <laughs> and they were throwing the smart Alex. Were throwing the ball from slips yes, straight to me of course they at were. mid off as hard as they could. <laughs> and I and then I try. You know, you just throw it to the bowler like yep. normally. And moves there, and I'm trying to, and I had to run just, over just and be hand flippant, it. you yeah. know, just like be oh. cool. Because I put it, it'd stay in my hand and go. Yeah. Out. <laughs> so I had to oh. run over to Mer, and then Dean. Oh, oh. But now oh, he averaged 43 in yes. shield cricket, 60 plus against Victoria, and he reckons he used to walk at you. He, when you come, he walk That's at true. you. Yeah, no, no, I can't remember that. No, exactly. <laughs> can't, he, he probably. To be fair to him, though, he, he wouldn't have got the length ball to walk at. Right? No. Yeah, because that's full of length, and that didn't happen. No. What Bill, did you say to him a couple of times? You... Oh, I, wasn't, I wasn't nice, Bill. No. I no. wasn't nice. But that was back but, when, when we got sorted out, we got to know each other. Yeah. He's, he's a beautiful man. Oh, but he is naturally arrogant. Well, about... that's that's why we didn't like him. Did Every time he walked out the bat, he looked like he had a like a silver spoon shoved up his. Well, well, you, well, said, you that's, actually said that's what he said. I, you, I, the middle stump. I, I thought you shoved... were being nice one day when uh, and it'd been going on for a while, and then Merv followed through and he said you're actually quite hard to bowl at. Yeah. And I thought, hello, this is actually going to be a compliment. <laughs> Something nice might eventually tumble and? out yeah. of M Hughes's mouth. I said, hey, why is that? He goes, because there's only two stumps to aim at, because you got the other one shoved up your. <laughs> And what about the story you told yesterday oh. when you actually saw him out? No, uh, I'll tell you what happened. Was, was oh, this, uh, this went on for... No, 10 reckon, years. Yeah, well, a, lot, a long years. time. Eight a years. Long time. Yeah. Eight yeah. years. And we, and we were playing at the MCG. <laughs> I, I tell this when, whenever anyone asks me about... Because I love Merv. Yeah. We, we'd, for about an hour, and it was, was stumps that night. And um, we must have declared overnight after. Anyway, so I'd been copping a pounding. The last ball of the day. He's bowling. I'm batting. Yeah. At the members' end at the MCG, and I knew it was going to be a bouncer, so he'd get, he'd, I'd had plenty that, over that the course obvious? of the hour. <laughs> this one went halfway down, I ducked under it, and he used to finish his run up about a metre away yeah, from you. Beautiful. Anyway, he'd used every bit of abuse he had in his <laughs> fat body. So he's standing there staring at me, and he goes, oh, I fucking hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't think of anything oh, else. He'd oh, run out of everything just else. Run out of everything anyway, else. but this is what I love, Bill, because a year <laughs> later, the first game of the season yep. was the same ground. Yes. South Australia versus right. Victoria. And I'm batting three, so a wicket fell, Merv's bowling. So it was your deja vu. Mm. Just I, cop it. Just give it to him. Yeah. So give it to good him. Move. Good, good. Middle and leg, although it probably was a bit big. Spot. Anyway, <laughs> uh, middle and leg. Leg and, and square and, leg umpire. And he comes and bowls the first ball, which was a bouncer again. Anyway, he follows through, memory like an elephant. He finishes a metre away from me and he goes, I still can hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Funny well, we both pissed ourselves laughing and then you just get on with it. But oh, Merv, as we go yeah. to the break, yes. we used to, in our day, you used to go and have a beer with the opposition. Yes. So it made you aware of the fact that all of that happened on the field, but once you got yeah. off it, it didn't matter. Yeah, it's interesting how people think. It overflows into the rooms and that. It, it may now because the blokes don't know each other. That's it. Um, so when we played, uh, rule of thumb was the batting team went into the fielding team's room yep. and you just caught up with blokes after it. If you had any, any differences, uh, you sorted out there. And it was none of this go to the media and, and sort it out no. through the media. It was sorted out through yourself. And I mean, we, we got on all right after, you after blokes, he gave me a spray. He, he we, wouldn't. We, you no, blokes, he did. He gave me the big spray out of that. Oh, you that. Blokes, I'm sick of this shit. <laughs> Been going on for 10 years. I've had a gun full. Find something new. I thought, oh, hello. Fair enough. Jeez, that Jim. Is, that is true. Then, yeah. then we had a beer that night. Yeah. And you figure out he's not a bad bloke. Yeah. Well, I had just been hitting the head. <laughs> well, and I was sick of that happening. 